So here is the room reveal. I bought this uh, mat from Smart Ladies Home. I don't know why, but I feel like a round mat will look better here than any other shape. If you remember before, I used to keep one here, but for a change and because to make it more manly and everything, I decided to keep it there. My son actually for the last few days has been working out there. This used to be their bedside table. I used to keep it in the center there. That's just a white coral that I spray painted black. There's a diffuser that I used to see. Bought this from AliExpress. These are actually mirrored letters. I spray painted them black as well. I like that rough touch to it. I got this as a gift when I bought that. And I find it really cute and lazy just like my boys. <laughs> um, so yeah, it's pretty. And I like the entrance. Yeah, we have the dart board. I like it. I like, the, I like the touch in here. I like that they can come here when they're mad or banned from playing game or TV and just start playing with it. I'm just worried they, they shouldn't ruin my paint up there when they miss. This is just a beautiful, beautiful piece. It, would ma it was made for me by um, the graphic world. Such, such a beautiful car. Teslas are amazing. I think it gives a very nice touch. This is where their old decoration used to be on top of the bed. I had uh, drilled holes to keep the paintings. But because I was in a hurry and I didn't have any patience, I decided to cover the holes with the stars. Hubby came home, he just approved. He didn't say anything, so we didn't fill the holes, but we should. I still have the filler. And uh, we made these out of tongue depressors. Yes, the doctor's tongue depressors. These are just DIYs. So you have like one, two, three piece, and then there's another here. We joined them together using a glue gun and then spray painted them. No, actually we spray painted after, yeah, after we've made the arrows. So I have two set of threes, these ones and this one. The idea was to have arrows on top of the beds um, as to indicate uh, a way or a road or, you know, a moving um, picture. This was Hubby's idea to have some facing down and the others facing up, like making an illusion of the car coming down and then going up. And here you have the rim covers. These are actually rim covers, not rims. Rims would be too big and protruding out here. So these are just uh, Nissan silver rim covers. We painted them black. And I think they look lovely with the arrows there. Huh, my favorite bit is this. So this is just a rope we bought and uh, we painted it using the uh, dye. Yeah, it boiled hot water, I put dye. Just like the way you learned dyeing in uh, home science. So we did that and then this wiring happened. We kept the bulb in there. Uh, I still need to find a permanent way to have these hidden and stored away so that you don't see the wires but even though I still really like it like that like I said the tough rough of you know no softness being a man's room I thought that was really cool told hubby just let it be for now I'm actually really liking it then here we have a tire that we had an extra one just laying there around we decided to paint it white as a tie is normally always black and i think it looks pretty cool i'm thinking of adding some a few um, details i'm not sure what i'm gonna do but for now this is where the wiring goes and i can actually turn the bulb up here on so it's easy for whoever is sleeping here, just put their hands there and turn it on. I think it looks amazing. I love, I love, I love this touch. Up here I kept that sofa that used to be in my bedroom. 
uh, I think it's just a good touch for the boys when they are playing or just having their friends over and not necessarily want to be on the beds for whatever purpose it's it gives a very good touch um, yeah I mean it's just those simple simple touch I just uh, finished filling that sp space there so the color hasn't been very well dried and I'll do another coat on it but I'm still impressed this is just amazing I so love it let me show you if I turn off the light how this would look okay lights guys okay this is how the bedroom looks now with that being the bedside light it's actually quite bright beautiful and you can't actually see because it brightens up even more through the phone that's not how I'm it, it looks like there's a ball of fire but that's not how it looks it's actually look it's pretty warm pretty cozy and just beautiful yeah I mean this is just the age is confusing they're still young but they're turning into boys I mean men you could say a 15 and a 10 year old so I couldn't do it very hard and masculine but I didn't want it to be toyish and cartoonish still I really hope you like and if you do please kindly give me a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and come back again come back again for more uh, DIY projects or just cleaning and motivation or just to see my daily routine and you're welcome so i appreciate you all thank you